Welcome to your wonderful Wednesday close-up view shave of the day. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving and welcome back. It's good to see you. Now, the winner for the 30 straight razor shave using only one straight razor is my Frederick Herder and Son. This is the number 49 that is bone with inlay and it is a full hollow. So this is shave one of 30. Here we go. Now, for our soap tonight, we're using Sterling Soap Company, and this is Black Eyes. So if you like old time licorice, this is your scent, Black Licorice. This is marvelous, and it has got some menthol in it. Yes, it does. Now, I have had that puck blooming. We're going to pour off that bloom water and put it on as a pre-shave. Yep. Yeah. There you go. And I want to let you know about the new Straight Razor Edge Friday special coming out this Friday. We're going to be talking about mapping your beard. So this is going to be good. Straight Razor Grips and the order in which you should shave. So that should be pretty interesting. So stay tuned for that. That's coming out on Friday. Now we are using my King brush. Yes, we are. This is just a beautiful handmade brush. Look at those wonderful colors. Oh, absolutely fantastic. That is a 24 millimeter bore knot and it's a premium bore knot at that now we're going to go ahead and get that loaded up yes we are all right well we made it to the midweek shave yeah the wonderful wednesday shave of the day hump day and hopefully you are doing well and the world's treating you good and you're in high spirits yeah it's really good to be able to be with you and have a good midweek shave. Oh yeah, hopefully your shaves are going well. And if you're part of the challenge for the 30 straight razor shaves in a row, only using one straight razor, let us know down in the comments on your progress so we can support you and give you encouragement. Yeah, I know uh, I saw Steven Davidson did his first shave yeah so that was excellent and i think we're there i think we're there on the soap look at this oh yeah oh nice 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 yeah so hopefully if you work your work week is going well and you are getting some good shaves yeah there we go now i'm gonna take that extra put that on Part of the pre-shave routine. That's what we do. Yeah, that's it. There we go. Now, there's that brush. Isn't that nice? Oh yeah, that's good. Good stuff. And now this has got some menthol in it, which I am liking. Okay, again, it's hot here. What's the weather like where you are? You know, are you getting some hot weather? We're getting hot weather, at least for us. Yeah. You know, I know out west they're getting much hotter weather than we are. Yeah. I come from Oklahoma, and now I'm in Connecticut. But uh, it's definitely different. Different out there. Oh yeah, we got soap flying everywhere. That's a good sign. Yes, it is. All right, here we go. Nice.
Wow, got that spot on just right off the bat. Very nice. Now, this is pass one. And for me, primarily, that's going to be with the grain. Let's do this. Reaching around with my offhand, stretching, laying the razor flat, getting that 20 to 30 degree angle for shaving just by raising the spine, the spine width off of my face. There we go. Yeah, got it really nice and hydrated. Going with the grain here. Very shallow angle. Oh yeah, that's good. Yes, it is. Actually, let me just clean that razor off before we go too much further. Nice and gentle, weight of the blade only. Flat right through here. Just rotating that razor around my chin, trying to maintain that flatness and get a really shallow angle on that chin area. Right through here, completely with the grain. Nice. Oh, that is good. Yes, it is. Nice flat angle here, going pretty much with the grain in that area. And then that's across the grain. There we go. This is good. I'm telling you, fantastic razor. Really is. Coming in straight here, rotating that blade down, looking for that good shaving angle. Nice and gentle when you come in with that razor. Pushing my teeth out on this lower lip to uh, flatten that area and get it stretched good. Yeah, this is a 15 16 blade and it's not a problem. It is not a problem. I actually uh, enjoy bigger blades anyway. So I started out with the 15 16 and it still works fine. Yeah. All right, let's switch hands. We're going to get this side. Stretching with my off hand, finding that angle for the razor, using short, easy strokes here. making it more controllable. All right. Yeah, definitely got that soap hydrated. Maybe a little more than I want, but that's okay. It's, it's good slick soap and it's got enough cushion. Coming in here, nice and flat. Got that good angle. with the grain right through there. Nice. Now right through here, this is pretty much across the grain for me. Stretching with my off hand. And shaving with my non-dominant hand. Clean that off before it falls off. 
<laughs> there we go. Nice. Now, just finish up a little bit down here. There we go. Now, we get this mustache area. Coming in nice and gentle here. All right, pass one complete. Very good. Now, let's get that rinsed off. See how we did. Look at that, isn't it great? Just blowing through those whiskers. Like there's no tomorrow. That is nice. Oh yeah. Now. Time for pass two. We're gonna get our lather on. Oh yeah, nice, nice. Oh, fantastic. And that menthol coming through like a champ. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, that's good. That is good right there. Now, we're going to switch up that handle a little bit. Coming in nice and flat with that razor. This is cross the grain in this area for the most part. All right, that's good. Right there. Now, this middle section, that is going to be more against the grain. The razor is nice and flat here. When you're going against the grain, that is going to be the most comfortable and the best shave that you're going to get. There we go. Now. Yeah, I got it that already. Stretching with my off hand here. Using short, easy strokes. Helping to make the shave more controllable. You don't need to use long strokes like you see some people use. This is all pretty much against the grain for me here on that cheek area.
All right. Now this soap is really nice and slick, so I can continue shaving with it like it is. I should have loaded the brush more though. Always load the brush more. More is better. Scratching here with my off hand. This is against the grain for me. Again, short, easy stroke. Nice and flat on that blade going against the grain. There we go. Nice, nice. Now we're going to just refresh. Now, if you're new, don't be afraid to refresh, okay? Just do it. You're going to get a better shave. So, it is totally worth it. Just go ahead, take the time, do a refresh, and it'll be fine. Yes, it will. Coming in with that blade nice and flat, going across the grain on this mustache area and around my mouth. There we go. That's nice. And right through here, this is with the grain again for me. Pushing that lip out with my teeth. Stretching any way I can. Oh yeah, good stuff. Wow, that licorice scent comes through. It is marvelous. Again, stretching with my off hand. The blade is nearly flat, going across the grain in this area. <laughs> nice. All right. Pass two complete. Very good. Now, let's get that rinsed off. Oh, cheeks are brilliant right where they are. Mm-hmm. Nice, nice, nice. Now we'll get that dried off. Don't need to introduce any more water into this soap. It is fine, just as is. There we go. That is good right there. Now, time for the half pass. Yeah. So basically, this is going to be against the grain on my jawline and my neck. Stretching with my off hand, pulling my ear. That razor is almost flat. Got a nice shallow angle on it using short, easy strokes. Move my hand down to my jawline so I can stretch my neck and jaw better. Again, the short strokes make it more controllable. And that is against the grain. Now right through here, this is going to be totally with the grain for me in that area. 
Okay, get that blade cleaned up. Now switch sides, switch hands. Stretching with that off hand. And now moving down to my jaw lines to stretch again. Nice, short, easy strokes. Again, very controllable. Got that blade at a good 20 to 30 degree angle. Yeah, the suds are falling off. That is so good. There we go. Nice. Nice and flat on that razor rotating around my chin again. Trying to keep it as flat as possible. Yeah, that is good. All right, there we go. Another shave in the books. Yep, let's see how we did. I think it's a good one. I do. Oh, wow. Oh, that is brilliant. It is. Wow. And there were no bumps harmed in the filming of this shave video. Yep. Now, this is Alan. And I put it everywhere. It is astringent and antiseptic, so it's good after shave, and it is awesome. I like it anyway. Now, I normally just dry that off. And if you have problems using alum, no big deal. Just do a cold water rinse followed by witch hazel. And for me, I'm following this by the Thayer's Lemon Witch Hazel. Yeah, this is so good. Yes, it is. Lemonade for the face right there. Yeah, fantastic scent. Oh, nice, nice. And I put it everywhere. I don't think you can go wrong with that at all. And we are doing some lucky tiger and this is the vanishing cream it is good this is um mint and menthol so let's go ahead get that rubbed in on the hands and put it on oh nice nice cooling effect And then I normally follow that with just a little water. Mmm. Kind of enhance the cooling effect. And next, we are topping this shave off with Osage Rub. Yeah, good stuff. Oh my goodness. We're gonna put that on and be in business. Oh, wow. Oh, that is so good. Yes, it is. All right. I do straight razor edge Friday specials on the first and third Friday of every month. You can click on this one to see my last straight razor edge Friday special where I announce the 30 straight razor shave challenge using only one straight razor. You can feel welcome to accept that challenge. Join in, let us know down in the comments and keep us up to date in the comments on, you know, shave one, shave two, shave three, all the way through so we can support you and encourage you along the way. Now, if you have been watching and you like what you see, consider subscribing. That would be awesome. If you have any questions, you know where to put them, all right? I do shave of the day videos every Wednesday and Sunday, so stop on by for that.
And down in the description, I have a ton of links of straight razor shaving and honing videos and playlists especially for you. Click up here to see my latest video. Click over here on a video especially picked out for you. Click up here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.